I was recently told I was too creative, that I wasn't Christ-centered enough. And the peeps we trying to reach wouldn't understand your speech. I told them it's cool, not an issue. I ain't so judgmental. Thanks for your advice. I'm just not afraid of heights. Like, like Christ wasn't afraid to mix spit with mud. As if he couldn't fix vision with one word, I'm sorry. I get my creativity from my father. Have you ever been to the aquarium? Google the coral reef for Pete's sake, thanks for your advice. I just lost my fear. Like I'm not afraid of a blank canvas. I ain't afraid to be the canvas. I've been marred in the potter's hands and God don't use erases, all for on purpose. But what keeps you up at night? Are you afraid of, of budget meetings or board of directors? Thanks for your advice. I've just lost my fear of gravity since his majesty came and grabbed me. I've often wondered, how loud does an alarm clock need to be to wake a dead man? Maybe you're right. I am too creative. See, I am afraid of being wrong. But if I am, tell me. I ain't afraid of correction. Humbly embrace lessons just like you shouldn't be afraid of city permits. And submit to the process. Because there's not one city permit that can stop what Elohim permits. I'm so comfortable with sovereignty. So done wasting words. So tired of lying to my father in the mirror. See, that's where I get my courage from, my spine. It ain't naturally stainless steel. But you can have freely what I've learned from failing miserably. And I guess this statement shook me because honestly, I'm terrified. I'm terrified of wasting time. But you can bet your good graces I ain't afraid of their faces. Hearts of men wax cold. Out your mind sold. It's the guts to say no, the nosedive. Follow commandments that don't make sense. God says learn to walk worthy. And if you understood the cross, you'd see that command was such a paradox. And I think I understand now. Between heresies and Pharisees. Between schemes to get rich and work to attain wealth. This is why I graciously smile, because truthfully, you're scared. They're scared like most of us are. That you finna waste another weekend. Spend a couple hundred bucks to do the same thing you've been doing. You scared. But your ideas ain't original. You are okay with mediocre. Your product is mediocre. And the best you've ever been and ever will be is so-so. Homie, this ain't a movie. You might go bankrupt and fail like the rest of us. You scared like I am. That I've grown irrelevant like, is this really happening? Am I still rapping? Still doing the same thing I was doing when I was 15. You scared. You only give because it's a tax write-off. Or to Africa to prove you ain't racist. When's the last time you gave a gardener a cup of water? I don't even know that groundskeeper's name and that Bakta wears a name tag. You scared. Your chairs are way too comfortable. And the cost of that one spotlight could have fed Angola. And it don't even bother you. You scared we born eagles walking among chickens as if these agitated shoulder blades ain't never sprouted wings. I was recently told I was too creative and, and that shook me to the core because I have no excuse for fear. I should be roller skating around Saturn looking down at satellites flying and if you mustered up the bravery, you'd get this one day. We fooled you. This ain't a conference. This right here is a runway. Why you ain't flying? You should take courage.